In this video, we will see how we can use Mohanta's pre-chopper in a heart cataract. This is a posterior subcapsular cataract with grade 4 nuclear sclerosis. And let us see the minimally edited surgery. This is the main incision with a 2.8 millimeter steel keratome. This is a bit of phenocaine. The patient is under topical anesthesia. The antechamber is filled up with visco, 2% SPMC. Now, a side port is made on the left side of the main incision about 3 clock hours away. And now, capsulorexis. This is a Lumera T microscope with beautiful red glow and the cataract appears soft with such good red glow. But this is actually a cataract with which is harder than grade 3. Capsulorexis is done, hydrodissection is done and now the nucleus is tapped. At this time I did not rotate the nucleus. We will do that after dividing the nucleus with the pre-chopper. Here goes the pre-chopper designed by me and in the left hand is the sustainer which is also designed by me. And now here goes the pre-chopper. This sustainer supports the opposite side of the nucleus and the nucleus is, yes, the one heminucleus has been divided into two pieces. And now, the hand piece goes with its bevel down. The nucleus sustainer is used to rotate the nucleus several times and now the two free nuclear pieces of one heminucleus is being emulsified. Ultrasonic energy used is 70 percent, flow rate is 48 ml per minute and vacuum is 480 millimeter of mercury. And now the other heminucleus which has not been divided is divided now in this way. We just have to learn how to hook the equator with this nucleus sustainer. It is a round bodied and ball tipped instrument and it is very safe. And now I am struggling to remove this epinuclear shell. I am mobilizing with the nucleus sustainer and ultimately I could mobilize it. Here it is. The nucleus and epinucleus is managed. Cortex can also be cleaned by the hand piece itself. But this is, it has a learning curve. So don't try this if you are, if, no, there are separate options to remove the cortex. And now hydroimplantation of a single piece monofocal intraocular lens is done. This is sensor on from Johnson & Johnson. I have no financial interest in the equipments and, uh, and the things that has been used in this surgery. The nucleus, both the haptics are in the capsular bag. This is a bit of moxie and then the side port is closed by corneal stromal hydration. And finally, this is the final lavage of the anterior chamber. At this time, any visco that sticks to the corneal endothelium is removed. A final polishing of the posterior capsule is done sometimes and any uh, cortical uh, any lens fiber sticking to the 
in any uh, area is removed and then the antechamber is nicely formed. After forming the antechamber with the Simco, integrity of the wounds are checked and the case is concluded. Thank you very much for your attention. Hope this video will help you in developing your surgical skills. It will encourage to use Mohanta's pre-chopper in your surgeries.